It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition for Monday, October 24th. I'm James Spann. Familiar setup here. Dry. Uh, we might mention a small chance of a shower Thursday, but prospects of a good rain here just not good for the next seven days. Let's dive in there and take a look. Water vapor satellite view ridging here across the deep south. Big trough coming into the western states and a trough up in the northeast. We note some high cirrus clouds around today that'll give probably a pretty decent sunset this evening to most people around here, but those are not rain producing clouds. Those are 20 to 25,000 feet up. Temperatures upper 70s to near 80, Tuscaloosa 79, Birmingham 80, 81, Anniston and Gadsden. We'll see highs pretty similar to that uh, each day for the rest of this week. Around the nation, I'd say temperatures are seasonal, maybe a smidgen above average where we are. But uh, that's not too far from what you expect for late October. Very quiet pattern across the nation. Again, that's pretty typical for October. I'd say this is the quietest month of the year nationally. Thunderstorms possible with a trough in the western states this evening. Tomorrow, a marginal severe weather risk for parts of the heartland. And on day three, maybe some thunder just north and west of here, but severe weather not expected. Rain for the next seven days, valid through Monday morning of next week. And yeah, we see that little sliver of green here, but don't get your hopes up. That's with a little wave coming through Thursday, but in a dry air mass, in a drought, you just figure it's not going to rain. Somebody might see a shower somewhere, but don't get your hopes up. Tropics can help us with rain. The Gulf of Mexico quiet, the Atlantic Basin quiet. Hurricane season runs through the end of next month, the end of November. All right, model fans, here we go. The 12Z GFS valid tomorrow at 1 o'clock local time. Troughing in the northeast United States. Got a flat ridge here. Like today, the sky will be mostly sunny. We'll expect a high around 81 or so. That's where the uh, uh, GFS is printing, 81 for Birmingham. This is Wednesday. We're dry. The high will be close to 80. We note that little compact uh, storm system that's a little east of Des Moines. And on Thursday, that surface low approaches Buffalo and Erie with a trailing front. And again, you see the slivers of green suggesting maybe some chance of a shower with a forcing with that front. But understand there's no moisture. The upper winds are light. It's just probably not going to happen. In fact, here's the NAM. Valid Thursday afternoon at 4 o'clock showing absolutely nothing. So a mix of sun and clouds, highs upper 70s. Chance of a shower, not zero, but it's, if anything happens, it's certainly not going to help our drought situation. Friday, we're dry. Weather for the weekend, pretty much the same thing. This is Saturday. Sunny, the GFS showing a high in the low 80s. Sunday, we're back in the 70s. The sky will stay sunny. A 1024 high north of us trying to nose in, but that should be a very nice day for Sunday. And this is Monday, a week from today, the end of October, Halloween. October 31st, a gentle northwest flow aloft and a dry air mass. That suggests highs in the 70s and lows down around 50. So let's go 10 days out, see if we can find any chance of rain here. This is valid Thursday, November 3rd. Pretty good shortwave coming into Texas. Could that be the thing that breaks the dry spell? Well, not at that point. We're still dry, but rain should develop over much of Texas, and we will see... If by chance, maybe that'll bring us some chance of rain out there toward November 4th, 5th, or 6th. Time will tell. Numbers, highs around 80 for the next seven days, dropping back in the 70s. Lows across the board, mostly in the 50s. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes of the blog the next video here by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. If you can, catch us this evening on the live stream or the television side, ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening, and God bless.